we didn't we didn't you know, like when we first started doing the show, it was everything was very defined in terms of the gender gender of male, female. And then you then we've had you know, we've had transgender, we've had gay, we've had lesbian, you know, and every somewhere in between. And and uh, and what you start to realize is there's this dominant and feminine that exists. Even if you, you call it masculine and feminine, but it's really dominant and, and subordinate. And that and the the the, the dynamics of that uh, kind of it lines up in the same way. As long like even so even in a gay relationship, you know who the dominant is and you know who the submissive is, and the same principles kind of work. If 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 you understand like a, a woman will always uh, a woman who is the submissive will always want a strong dude. <laughs> So if she can bully him around and the stronger she is, the stronger she wants to do to be. And so if she can bully him around, it's only a matter of time. So she's she's done. She's cutting that dude off because it's not her job is to push him to test what his strength is. And he has to be confident enough in himself, what he does, how he defines himself to go. No, that, that I'm not doing that. Yeah. And it, it's a it's a difficult dynamic. How how's that work in your relationship? I find that I'm, you know, I, I am a, a feminine man in certain respects. So I feel like there is a, you know, sometimes switching of who's more dominant, who's more submissive. But like, I, I certainly know from from dating that where I would meet a certain woman who like wanted a more dominant man. And I was like, you won't like me. me. <laughs> you won't dig me. Yeah. I, uh, I remember once I, I did this show where I, pl- I, I did like a play, an interactive play. And I played this Italian Goomba type character. I was replaced by a uh, Vinny from the Jersey Shore. So it was like a okay. masculine role. Right, right. This woman like s- came up to me after the show, and I was like a dick. I'd walk around and make dirty lines, all this shit. <laughs> and this woman came up to me like way out of my league, just a different, just a different world. <laughs> from me. And I remember she like we we all went out to drinks after the show, and I put on my glasses and I put on my button down. And I was like, "Hi, how are you?" And I could see just the the the. Oh, she was like, "Oh, this dude is not." And I thought, like, can I stay in character all the way to you know <laughs> having sex with this with this woman? But I I no, I can't. Yeah. So I feel like there's definitely like I have a I have a very strong Jewish woman I'm dating now, and I I certainly think there is a you know it's a trope a stereotype, but there are the Jewish women. I'm a Jewish man, and sometimes they can be more dominant right. uh, in certain dynamics. So I think there's a there's a little balance I have to find with most of my. Yeah, I mean the the balance is fine, but it's it, what's interesting is have you ever said that to a girl like oh you just you're not gonna like me like you, this you, have you actually stopped it and said that I don't know I think that I think they just I think they are more in to like they can feel it before I need to say anything right like they just but you've never not said it. that you've never said that. No, not directly. I should. I should be more direct. Like, look. That's why you asking, right? Huh? What'd you say? It would work like opposite. If you yeah, that. because if yeah, you say it. that, then that makes you dominant. The the, the see the the, the 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 confidence is not really what you perceive it as as this Italian goomba. In fact, that guy a lot of times is one of the biggest pussies in the world. I mean, you know, you, we've, what was it? Uh, casino It's like, Cameron, Cameron, put the, put the gun down, you know, like it's that, that begets that because you're not really that guy. Like they, they, I think they smell the authenticity of it. But when, if you initially said, yeah, you, you looking for some dude that's like, because that's kind of what Andre does. Like you, you looking for dude with problems, like, <laughs> like you want problems. You want drama. I'm nah, I'm not, I'm not fucking yeah, like, which, yeah. which is, you know, he doesn't have, Andre doesn't have that kind of feminine energy, but the fact that he's willing to go, yeah, you, you're not good enough is the thing that flips the whole dynamic around. You know what I mean? And I, I'm not even trying to say that they're not even good enough. It's just like, I'm not, I'm not interested in the lifestyle that you that you want. yeah, which is not I mean so, it's, 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 I don't want about that. my business. I don't want like, that. <laughs> I don't get down like that. I want better for myself. I don't want your man. man. I don't want to have to look, I don't want to have to get up and get my car and the, the butt of your man's 30 rusty 38 is on my temple. He wanna know Ooh. why I'm <laughs> why I'm in the project. I don't want none of that. <laughs> 
I let it be known, yo. I'm not interested. Young man school 202. Better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again. I'm not an alpha male. I'm not a beta male either. I'm just a better man. Better man. Put your happiness first because if you don't, they won't.